Hello and welcome to Beach and Beyond. I'm Melanie Purcell with the Worcester County Office of Tourism here on Maryland's coast. Today's show is going to be very exciting. We're going to be talking to Ivy Wells in Berlin about the Arts and Entertainment District and all the stuff going on there. We're also going to reach out to Kara Lacey with the town of Pocomoke City. And we've of course got Secrets on the way and Rena Thaler with the Art League of Ocean City. So enjoy the show. Hi everybody, it is Brianna Dix with Worcester County Tourism and Economic Development Office and today I am in the beautiful Cypress Park in downtown Pocomoke, right on the Pocomoke River and I'm standing next to Kara Lacey, the events and downtown coordinator for the city of Pocomoke. Mm -hmm. And we are at a beautiful park here, absolutely beautiful, right on the Pocomoke River. Can you tell us about some of the amenities that the community can check out here? Sure, so Cypress Park is one of our jewels here in downtown Pocomoke. We have a nice amphitheater behind me where we have um, concerts and events we have pavilions that can be rented we have a playground a nature trail uh, walking on the docks and then our newest addition is six brand new pickleball courts and one tennis court Wow, and I also see the skate parks back there, so yes. kids get, and adults can bring your skate parks or your rollerblades or what have you to come yeah. check that out too. Can you tell us what kind of events are happening here in Pocomoke? Sure, so we have a concert in the park summer series. Uh, so every Thursday in the summer at 7 p.m. we have free concerts back here on the amphitheater. So you can pack a picnic, a lawn chair, and enjoy a free concert every week till September 1st. And then we also have our monthly Fourth Friday Street Festivals. They run uh, through September, so 5 to 8 p.m., live music, sidewalk vendors, food, beer and wine for the adults, and things for the kids to do too. Our biggest event coming up in uh, this month in August is the annual Pocomoke Boat Docking Challenge. That's on Saturday, August 13th, and uh, gates open at 11, practice runs begin at 1, and then the competition starts at 2. And the cool thing is after that's done, we have a live band and a fireworks show over the Pocomoke River, so that's really something to see. And uh, if you want to jump ahead till fall, we also have the downtown Pocomoke Fall Festival. That's Saturday, October 8th. That is our big family friendly event uh, that the merchants give back to the residents and guests of Pocomoke. Hay rides, pumpkin painting, costume contests, all kinds of fall fun things to do. Yeah, that sounds exciting. A lot of free fun for families and people of all ages here in Pocomoke. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us what kind of business is has opened recently and is new here? Sure, so we have a lot of new restaurants actually in Pocomoke. Our newest restaurant in downtown Pocomoke is the Christmas Suite. They opened about a year ago. They have great lunch specials as well as coffee and beverages. And then our newest restaurant in Pocomoke is Polo Rico. That's a Mediterranean style restaurant with a huge menu. It's absolutely delicious. And then later this year, we will have a brewery opening downtown called Cypress Roots Brewing Company. And we're really excited for them. Cool, that sounds delicious. And I think making me a little hungry right <laughs> now. So where can people get more information about all the fun and new things happening in Pocomoke? Uh, for more information and a full calendar of events, they can visit downtownpocomoke.com to see what's going on in our town. Awesome, well, we hope to see you guys here soon, maybe on the Pocomoke River and checking out the city of Pocomoke. Water damage can cause serious problems at your home or business. At Royal Plus, we have decades of experience serving commercial and residential properties. If your property has water damage, call Royal Plus at 866-404-7587. Hi everyone, I'm Rena Thaler, Executive Director of the Art League of Ocean City. And I'm joined by Megan Burek, our Social Media Coordinator and Education Assistant. And we are here to tell you why art matters this month. Brought to you by Ocean Downs Casino where the fun shines. So Megan, today we're outside here in front of the Art Center, in front of the tennis courts on 94th Street, mm -hmm. um, because August we have a lot of outdoor activities going on this month. We so. do. Um, so we have our annual plain air event happening this month, um, where we're 50 artists are gonna take to the Ocean City streets and beyond and paint um, in plain air, which means in the open air. Um, and then we'll have a wet paint sale as well. 
kind of like a festival atmosphere yes. on uh, August 13th on Saturday night and again on Sunday mm -hmm. after the artists come back from painting on the boardwalks and plein air is almost like um, a fishing tournament but with painting, <laughs> Definitely. right? There's a lot at stake too. Uh -huh. um, and then our juror is going to be Crystal Mall and her painting is actually um, going to be raffled off so definitely get your raffle tickets for that. Um, and then we also have Art X at the end of the month as well at Northside Park. Uh, we have a bunch of different classes going on there as well as activities, so definitely stop by there. Yeah, Art X is a great art and music festival put on by the town of Ocean City mm -hmm. with help from the Art League of Ocean City and other community um, arts organizations. So mm -hmm. lots of vendors and, as you said, workshops, food trucks. The Ocean City Film music. Festival will be showing um, some films there for each right. day. Yeah. So great, great weekend. Lots of arts this month yeah. in um, Ocean City. And we're standing here in front of our um, mural on the tennis courts. That's really a unique experience. If people, have, folks have not been up here on 94th Street to visit the art center, come up and, and at least see the um, out, artwork outdoors. Mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about how this mural was done and, and so what people could this expect. This mural is by Jean Anderton, um, and she had um, found objects from the Ocean City boardwalk, whether it be trash or na like naturally occurring things like seashells and she um, put them on these works of paper and the sun actually left an imprint mm -hmm. um, and we have blown those up and they're all along this wall of the tennis court. Right so those are called cyanotypes when they're made with the solar prints but it tells a really neat story and um, about recycling and um, a trash little bit about treasure trash to treasure mm -hmm. right so come on up check out the mural and then we are open seven days a week and we have so much going on in the building as well with classes and yes. events this month so yes. what can you highlight on some of the classes that, that people can expect um, we'll definitely check out the art x classes you'll be making um, uh, summer beach paintings or um, you'll be painting oyster shells there's a kids class as well and then we always have um, painting watercolor drawing classes pottery we got a great pottery studio here glass classes as well kids um, and adults mm -hmm. right kids and adults all ages all skill types um, and all of that is online at artleagueofoceancity.org mm -hmm. and then our featured artist this month Kirk McBride yes. will be here with his um, beautiful exhibit first Friday night of the month is our opening reception 5 to 7 p.m. it's always free and open to the public and mm -hmm. um, hors d'oeuvres and beverages so Everybody's invited to stop by and see Kirk's work, and, and we'll be giving away a piece of his um, work, a print, yes. if you become a member this summer. So yes. a little bit about our membership drive. Yes. So, so definitely check that out. Um, everything is online, artleagueofoceancity.org, or stop by. We're open seven days a week, um, 9 to 4 Monday to Friday, and 11 to 4 on the weekends. Come see us and make some art. Sign up and win up to a cool 500 in free play instantly. <laughs> oh, shell yeah. Reel in big jackpots via shark at the tables. Ocean Downs Casino, where the fun shines. Hey guys, it's Dorian and Wes and also Reed. <laughs> yeah, we're going to ride awesome rides. They're going to be super fun. Okay, we're going inside. It's going to be such a fun time. What I want is Splash. It's funny. 
because like they make it start to go, it, it goes slow, and then like if they have like it going straight down at one part, so the slides go really fast. They go like that fast. You have to get crazy in the little hook. I love Jolly Rogers because it's like so many surprising things. Pete is going to go down the big one. Awesome! I'm going down the master blaster with my dad. I'm 43 inches and I'm stoked to ride down this. We're going to go down the eye of a hurricane and it's going to be cool. The last thing we're going to do is the wave pool. We're going to have such fun! We're leaving Jolly Rogers Water Park and it was the best day ever! Distilling Company, Ocean City's first distillery since Prohibition. Travel back in time for a behind-the-scenes tour full of history, one-of-a-kind antiques, and a story or two along the way. From grain to bottle, learn the process by which we make our award-winning spirits. Over 40 and counting. Tours offered every day from 11 till 5 and include three tastings of your choosing. Book yours today by visiting SecretsDistilling.com. Hello, and welcome to Secrets Jamaica, USA. We're located at 49th Street in Ocean City, Maryland. Secrets is open Sunday through Friday at 11 a.m. and Saturdays at 10 a.m. Check out our new menu next time you're here while enjoying our Bayside Dining under the palms. Some favorite dishes are the nachos, jerk chicken and jerk shrimp, barbecue ribs, and our new jerk chicken rice bowl. We have live entertainment every night with the area's best bands and DJs. Dance the night away at one of our five stages, including the Morley Hall nightclub. We've also got some great shows coming up as a part of the Secrets and Ocean 98 summer concert series. Article Sound System with special guest Trevor Young will be here Tuesday, August 16th. And Ayaterra with Mike Love will be here Sunday, August 21st. For the full schedule, check out secrets.com backslash calendar. Over at Secrets Distillery, they have been working hard nonstop to bring you award-winning secret spirits. Distillery tours are available every day from 11 to 5 p.m. See how we make our spirits and learn about the Prohibition era with over a million dollars of antiques from the early 1900s. Tours are $15 and include three tastings of your choice. Make your reservations today at secretsdistilling.com. The Atlantic Beverage Center, located in Secrets Parking Lot, has all your needs covered for liquor, beer, and wine. And your day just got 1.75 liters better. Now available only at the ABC are Secret Spirits Handles. We have our Spice Drum, Lemon Drop, Orange Vodka, and Regular Vodka, all now available in 1.75 liter bottles. Stop in from 2 to 5 and take 10% off everything in the store including our ready-to-drink cocktails, Orange Crush, Electric Lemonade, and Big Bamboo. Also, make sure you take advantage of the Secrets Distilling Bottle Buyback Program. Bring in an empty bottle of Secret Spirits and get $2 off your next Secret Spirits purchase. And that includes the new handles. We hope to see you soon at Secrets, Secrets Distillery, or the Atlantic Beverage Center. Find us and get lost. <laughs> Visit Secrets Jamaica, USA and make any day the perfect getaway. Join us for delicious eats in our Bayfront dining area and treat yourself to a tropical drink or local craft beer under the palms. Then, when the sun goes down, the fun heats up. Home to the Morley Hall nightclub, Secrets is your entertainment hotspot with live music every night. Secrets Jamaica, USA. Find us and get lost. Enjoy summer in Ocean City, Maryland with free family fun happening all summer long. 
Enjoy drone shows on the boardwalk, Sundays in the park with fireworks, beach movies, beach dance parties, and summer programs at the Ocean City Life Saving Station Museum, all completely free. Ocean City has something fun for everyone. Happiness is calling, and family memories are waiting to be made. Enjoy summer in Ocean City, Maryland. Learn more at OCOcean.com. Hello and welcome to Beach and Beyond. I'm Melanie Purcell with the Worcester County Office of Tourism here on Maryland's coast. And today we are on the beautiful Ocean City, Maryland boardwalk. It's a stunning day. Yes, yes. I have two of my best friends with me. I have Susan Jones with the Hotel Motor Restaurant Association. Hi, everybody. Jessica Waters with the Town of Ocean City, Office of Tourism, Communications and Marketing. So we're gonna talk all summer today. Summer's here. Summer is I know here. It. I, I wish we were in our suits and on the beach. I know, right? <laughs> Seeing the ocean right there, it's kind of a, a little bit tempting, but uh, lots of free family fun, lots of new things going on in the industry. So I wanted to kick it right over to Susan to talk about yeah. for our guests that are coming to Ocean City as well as our locals that might want to do a staycation. You know, it's a great place to come. It's a great time to come, but the really best thing about OC Ocean right now is a button. It's called Book Direct. Mm -hmm. So you can go on and put your dates in and it can give you places who have availability and you can book direct with the hotels. Mm -hmm. And it's very important to book direct with a hotel and not through a third party because then you avoid any confusion. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the best thing about staycations are there's so many free things to do in Ocean City, Maryland, right Jess? Yep, yes. Absolutely. This is the time where we have free events happening pretty much every single day of the week, which is exciting. Uh, some of my personal favorites are movies on the beach, which happen on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. We have Sundays in the park on Sundays. We have drone shows that happen right here on the beautiful boardwalk. Uh, what am I missing, girls? Sunset Park party, party nights. nights. Right on the bay side. Of course, beach North dance side parties. park with there's, Sundays. Yeah. Yeah. There's and actually the library something. added summer reading on Wednesdays, yep. which is fun. And the museum has free programs. There's literally something yes. for everyone here and it's completely free. So if you're looking for something extra to do while you're in Ocean City, even if you're making a trip down for dinner and you want to add on a movie, now's the time to do it. It's, you want to go to oceocean.com uh, backslash events and check out all the free events that we have going on for the entire summer. And we appreciate working with Ocean City throughout the county. We've got lots of free events in Worcester County, uh, Berlin, Snow Hill, and Pocomoke, as well as Ocean Pines. There's farmer's markets, first, second, and third Fridays, concerts. So there's just so much going on throughout the county. And one of our biggest events this summer that we all look forward to, of course, in August is the White Marlin Open. Right. And That's of funny. course, we're adding for the second year Marlin Fest. It's going to actually be down at the inlet this year. So you'll be able to experience that. Lots of great family fun um, with the White Marlin Open. Of course, one of our signature events, as well as all the free family Because they're going to have live music at yep. Marlin yep. Fest. And that's one of the great things about Ocean City. There's live music all over town. All over. And speaking of live music, I heard we're getting Jay Copeland, yeah, American, American Idol. American Idol from yes. Southern yes. Mary. Yes. We're yeah. celebrating Independence Day a little differently this year, but we're excited. We're going to yes. have fireworks downtown and an amazing concert by Jay Copeland uptown from American Idol and our hometown hero. He's right here from Salisbury. So we're thrilled. Yes. Yes. Summer is packed full of fun here in Ocean City. So if you haven't made a trip to the beach, now's the time. And it there's is. always Ardex at the end oh of the summer, gosh. right? Can't forget Ardex. Again, yes. another charming event around the lagoon at Northside Park. You don't have to actually be an art enthusiast to enjoy Ardex, which I find, you know, it's, it's something for everyone. There's, yep. there's crafts, there's gifts. Um, it's just a nice time to be outside. Look at this weather. Look at oh, where we live. Wow. We're so we lucky. So we tons lucky. of things to do outside. I'd say go to OC Ocean and book a trip today. Book your trip. And even if you're a local, come experience. This is a great time of year to put your feet in the sand, in the water, yes. and just really, really enjoy summer here in Ocean City, Maryland. Yeah. Sophia's Italian restaurant in Ocean City serves lunch and dinner with specialty dishes prepared by our chef Salvatore. Homemade delectable dishes like... out delivery or dine in Sophia's Italian restaurant how are you my name is Anthony and this is Courtney beside me we're down here on 16th Street on the boardwalk at the Ocean City Rum Shack and we're gonna sit here and talk about some specials that we have coming up some really fun and exciting things that we're gonna be running here so I'm gonna pass it over to Courtney she'll tell you some events that are coming up all right we have Malibu Mondays you, you come to 6th Street Street in the boardwalk at Ocean City Rum Shack you buy a Malibu cocktail I mean you can have a Bay Breeze you can have a Malibu rum punch you can have a Malibu Bay Breeze cocktail in a can you can 
can buy any Malibu cocktail, and guess what? You get a free T-shirt, and you get to tie-dye it any way you like, customize. All right, next thing, Thursdays, we have Smirnoff carnival parties. All right, we have Jenga, we have pick a duck, we have spin the wheel, and you can win prizes from tumblers to t-shirts to lanyards to any kind of merchandise. And that's what we have Mondays and Thursdays. And guess what? Fridays are even better. Okay, and let's yes, go. What you do can, we have? So you can come and fiesta with us from 3 to 5 on Fridays. We're going to have a bunch of specials, including Coronas and Margaritas. Taquitos are hot on the grill. We also have... Uh, Oh, Watermelon wait, punch bowls. We have seafood nachos that pair perfectly with it. We can even enter your name in a raffle to win a pinata full of minis. So that's going to be exciting each and every Friday from 3 to 5. We have a DJ on that day. We have a DJ on Thursday from 1 to 3 for the carnival. We also have a DJ on Monday from 1 to 3 for Malibu Mondays. So there's a lot of live music, a lot of specials, a lot of fun here all summer long. And uh, you can pair it with some wonderful coastal salt food as well. Over here, we briefly mentioned you have the seafood nachos, one of Courtney's favorite. Oh, yeah. We got that true Maryland crab. I mean, true Maryland lump crab meat with fresh jumbo lump shrimp, jalapenos, homemade pico de gallo, homemade queso, guacamole, fresh homemade guacamole. Put that alongside some blackened mahi tacos, house-made chipotle aioli, corn and black bean salsa. That is perfect for any summer day, especially Fiesta Friday. You could even grab a tuna, tagrashi tuna banh mi, that we have with a house-made kimchi aioli on there. You have it on ciabatta toasted bread and oh. ahi seared tuna. Hey! Uh, that's what's the, the best shack. about 16th Street in the boardwalk. We're having a lot of fun. Yes. We have a lot of food to pair with it. We have wonderful beer buckets that you can design, starting yeah. with my favorite, Coastal Love Hazy IPA. We have six different Very frozens different. to pick from, the best you can get on the beach. We have buckets, we have crushes. Anything you want, there's plenty of fun down here, plenty of drinks and plenty of great food coming from Coastal Sauce. So come down and have a good time with Courtney and I and all the rest of the wonderful staff here. Oh, nice come seeing to, you guys. See you on 16th Street soon. Coastal Smokehouse, Steaks and Bourbon in West OC. Coastal Smokehouse, Steaks and Bourbon, Ocean Gateway, West OC. Welcome to Beach and Beyond. I'm Melanie Purcell with the Worcester County Office of Tourism here on Maryland's coast. And I have a guest with me today, Ms. Ivy Wells. How are Hello. you, Ivy? I'm she good. is the Director of Economic and Community Development for the town of Berlin, one of the gems here on Maryland's coast in Worcester County. And we are at a really unique location today we in are. front of Oxer Studios. And so we're going to talk all things art. The arts are alive in Worcester County and especially in Berlin. in Berlin. So what's going on, Ivy? So we are a designated arts and entertainment district. And what that means is we have a variety of public art. We've got a, a ton of live music venues here. We have right behind us glass blowing studio, Jeff Oxer Designs, uh, another glass blowing studio, Beach Memories. We've got a historical mural, we've got a fun mural, and we have an interactive mural. Oh wow. And one of our newest and most prominent murals here in Berlin is the Reverend Charles Albert Tindley. We were just recently there for the unveiling and that is just such a spectacular sight. So kind of how did that come about and what is the significance there? Sure. Well, what people don't realize is that Reverend Tindley was born here in Berlin. He became famous as the godfather of gospel music and, and we needed to celebrate that. We needed to showcase who Reverend Tindley was and we dedicated an entire wall to him. Um, a local musician wrote a song about him and it, it's a really special project. We feel very fortunate to be able to work on that. Yeah, and, and at the unveiling I know the family was here and it was just such a moving and special time for the residents of Berlin and then all the visitors that come here and, and experience that mural. So it just it, it was a really great opportunity to showcase somebody who meant so much to Berlin and we, we decided to own that he was born here, and I think not Philadelphia, right? <laughs> right, right. He was Berlin-born, 
And the interesting thing about the mural is that everyone got to watch the artist paint the mural while mm -hmm. it was going on, and that was just spectacular. And it looks like that that wall on Bruder Hill it was made for that mural. Yeah. And I know there was a lot of discussion of where does it go, and a lot of work went into it, and so I think it just turned out perfectly. Yeah, so. it was a beautiful mural. And I know that the Beach to Bay Heritage Area uh, really was instrumental in making that happen, and we were kind of a part of that whole initiative, and so yes. with tourism and economic development, so it's really exciting to see something like that come alive. And, you know, speaking of the arts, you know, you can come and experience that in Berlin, but also, how about the dining? So we have become a culinary destination with a variety of restaurants, bake shops, we have a chocolatier here, ice cream. You can never go hungry in Berlin. Yeah, and, and every time you come, it's a different experience. Completely, sure. completely different every time. And, you know, people like to get ice cream. They walk around at night. They enjoy the beautiful art. Um, the other thing about our downtown shops is that they feature local art in their shops. Mm -hmm. And many of these, many of the artists like to showcase their work in our downtown shops. And the Worcester County Arts Council is right here in Berlin. And so you can go in there, you can become a part of that organization and you can display your art in there. Absolutely. And, and during the farmer's market, uh, the Worcester County Arts Council opens up early and many of the shops opens early too. And the other cool thing is being able to create your own art. I know here at the Glass Blowing Studio, that's a big thing around the holidays. You can create your own ornaments. So you can really be a part of the arts on any level here in Berlin. And for more information, where do people go, Ivy? You can go to BerlinMainStreet.com or specifically about our arts district, you can go to BerlinArtsDistrict.com. Great. Thanks so much. You're welcome. It's Todd from Park Place Jewelers. Summer is here, so let us make it special with a gift of fine jewelry. A spectacular line of sea life and nautical jewelry with designers like Denny Wong and Stephen Douglas. Ocean City sand bracelets, pendants, and rings, so you can take a piece of the beach home with you. Ocean jewelry with Swarovski crystals to light up those Ocean City memories. And special Ocean City Pandora charms. So let Park Place Jewelers put a sparkle in your jewelry collection this summer. Thank you so much for joining us today with Beach and Beyond. We hope you enjoyed the show. Make sure to tune in every Sunday morning at 10 a.m. on WMDT.